This is a story of deceit, manipulation, lots of money, political lobbying, lawsuits, and ultimately covert theft. The history of the internet has been one of big capital pilfering from public investment and in national infrastructure, the expropriation of academic research, of democratic open source alternatives being forced illegally from the market, of devices to steal our privacy for profit being quickly snuck into our homes, our cars, our watches, glasses and phones. It's a story of unethical business practices, of monopoly power, a story that could have been different, and, in the end, a story of competing dreams, hopes for the future. It's a big history, one that needs to be told properly and one in which that verb, to steal, will be returned to. Stealing can happen in many ways, through force, through dispossession, through tricks, power and cash, of physical infrastructure, and ideas, attention and privacy can be stolen as much as hardware and physical goods. We'll see how this story has some striking parallels throughout history, this is the story of the ideologies, the battles, the court cases, the innovations, the lost hopes. From Microsoft to Uber, from eBay to Google, from the US Department of Defense to dimly lit university laboratories in basements, from Napster to 9-11, this is the story of the internet.